what's up guys i'm <clears throat> back with another video guys um this one is mine it's gonna be stiller's 2017 schedule prediction video guys nfl released the all team schedule last night guys i figured why not run over my team schedule and predict their win loss record guys without further ado guys let's get ready to check out my stiller's schedule all right starting off the season we open up against the cleveland browns Ooh. <clears throat> So that's going to be a W right there. I got Pittsburgh coming out strong to start the season out. Ben, Val, and Brown going to come out hammering. We're going to put up 38 points on the Browns. So I got the Steelers beating the Cleveland Browns to go to 1 0. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? And then we get our home opener, guys. At minute, we play against Minnesota Vikings. That should be a pretty good game. But I don't know. I don't think they have anybody. They don't have AP no more. So. I got Steelers winning that one too. I got Pittsburgh going to the home opener, giving the fans a reason to cheer and celebrate that Steelers up to even 2 0. And then they travel to Chicago to take on the Lonely Bears. The Bears have not been a good team in the past three years. The Bears have <laughs> Cutler's gone now, so I think they got McCown or Sanchez or somebody they picked up, right? And then they, just, they got Mark Sweet and he played for Steelers, so. But I see Pittsburgh beating the Bears at 24 to 10 or something like that. So Steelers go 3 0. Next, they play against the Baltimore Ravens. Ooh, at Baltimore. That could be a game that Baltimore steals a little upset in like a 9-7 ball game, guys. So I have Baltimore. I hate to say it, but I have Baltimore with the upset. So I got Pittsburgh losing to Baltimore to go 3-1. Next, they play a home game against Jacksonville. Oh, the Jaguars, Blake Bortles, um, who else did they have? Allen Robinson, um, Alex Terrence. Oh, that's gonna make a good game. Jacksonville somehow seems to always beat us every single year. But I got Pittsburgh in a close one, 21 14. Pittsburgh would be 4 1 now. Next, we play at Kansas City Chiefs, a rematch from the wild card game. No, from the divisional game. Yeah. Pittsburgh versus KC. Mm. I'm gonna say that KC still won against the Steelers, 21 to 20. I got KC upsetting us in a really, really good game at Kansas City. Those fans are gonna be wild, but I don't think we have enough to pull it off. I have KC winning that one, move us to four and two on the season. Next, we play a home game against the Bengals. I hate the Bengals. We're about to come in there on fire. We're about to, I wanna say we trash the Bengals. I got Pittsburgh winning that one against easily. No contest game. We're gonna blow off the Bengals. All right. Next up, we have at Detroit Lions. Oh, on the Sunday night game. Oh, that's gonna be amazing, yo. That's gonna be a great game. Darius Slay versus Antonio Brown. Big Ben versus Matthew Stafford. Oh, but I got us winning that game. It's gonna be a good Sunday night game, guys. A one for a great game. Um, I see us taking it 24. Pittsburgh is a close win. Big Ben throws a nice game winner touch on the AB. Then we go on our bye week. And then we play at the Indianapolis Colts. The past two years we played them was at Pittsburgh. So we played the Colts for the third consecutive year. We beat them every year by more than 20. So I think it continues. We're going to go into Indianapolis. Angel Oscar have nothing against Big Ben and the Steelers. And I got Pittsburgh dogging the Colts again 41 17, guys. Pittsburgh's going to win that one. It'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we'd be six and two right now. Six and two, guys. Here we go. And then we play the Tennessee Pants on a Thursday night game, guys. My birthday is the 19th, so we don't. It's a Sunday, but we don't play on that Sunday. But I guess it's okay because we play on the Thursday before. That can be our color rush game where we wear those. Um, I'll show you guys real quick. We wear those color rush uniforms. Mm -hmm. That's the, this is the day we'll be wearing them now. So, look at that. There they are. What color rush or whatever. There they are, guys. Oh, let me get it. That's my favorite. Last year, I was at that game. It was on Christmas, right here. Where, um, we had these jerseys on, and Antonio Brown had the game winning immaculate. Oh, I don't know what he did. He extended the ball and he got it over, guys. That game was, oh, that's what put us in the playoffs. They're right here, guys. Here they are. They're in their jerseys, and that was the freaking 
that was the greatest play by far, guys. Look at that. Insane. But yeah, we'll be wearing those against the Titans. Um, I got Pittsburgh easily over the Titans. Mariota is not going to be enough. I got Pittsburgh easily. 35-17. Next up, at Pittsburgh, a Sunday night game. Big Ben Roethlisberger versus Aaron Rodgers. Jordy Nelson versus Antonio. Oh my god, this is going to be a great game. I can't wait for this game. It's going to be awesome, yo. Um, Bruh. Green Bay at Pittsburgh. Ooh. I'm going to have to uh, take the Packers on this one. I think Aaron Rodgers is going to be too enough for our defense to handle. I got Green Bay 35-30. Huh? Whoa. Underdog? Well, right. Me? I, I don't think so. But no, no, me either. <laughs> I, don't, I would never be an underdog. It's going to be a great-ass game, but I got Green Bay winning that one. And then we played a Cincinnati thing. It was a Monday night football. I got Pittsburgh beating the Bengals twice this season. I got Pittsburgh going into Cincy, trashing the Bengals again. Well, Maybe a close game of 10, 24 to 10 or something like that. Next up, we have a home Sunday night game again against the Baltimore. Look at that. Boom. Three back-to-back -back night games. But anyway, we played the Ravens on NBC Sunday night in Pittsburgh. The fans are going to be wild. That's going to be a game that's going to clinch us our playoff spot. <clears throat> I got Pittsburgh defeating Baltimore again, 20 to 17. Um, what's his name? Chris Boswell is going to make a 45-yard game winner field goal. Next up, we play against the Cheaters. Oh, my God. New England at Pittsburgh. Big Ben versus Brady. Antonio Brown taking up against um, Malcolm Butler. Oh, my God. They just, they just picked up Brandon Coach, too. As I, much as I hate to say it, I see the Patriots beating us again. Somehow, we do not seem to beat the Patriots either. Either we're injured or something doesn't go right. But I have the Patriots winning against us in week 15 um like 31 27 it doesn't matter they're gonna beat us in the regular season but in the afc title game pittsburgh is gonna beat new england to go to the Super Bowl. you heard it here first all right anyway texans monday night game Ooh. no it's a christmas game okay christmas monday night game okay let's see it Pittsburgh versus Texans. Oh, I got Pittsburgh winning this one. It's going to be a good Christmas game. We won last year on Christmas. I can see us winning this game. Nice Christmas present. Pittsburgh takes home the victory, guys. Uh, so, here we go. Our last game against the Browns. I have us right now at 11-4, um, and four, guys. So, we will play Cleveland at our last game. It's a home game. I see us taking the victory. Ended off the season right. 12-4. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Pittsburgh Steelers will be 12 and 4, guys. There you have it. My 2017 Steelers schedule predictions video, guys. I have a show on 12 and 4, guys. I don't know. What do you guys think the Steelers record would be? Who's your favorite team? Comment down below. How good is your guys' record? Um, what do you predict the record? If you guys heard a reaction, please leave a like on it. Comment down below your prediction or whatever. Who's your favorite team? And uh, subscribe to your guys' Peace out.